beautiful people. Today I'm going to be reading again from the book titled Bum Rush the Page. It is an anthology of um, different poets. So there's another one that I want to share from here. And this one is titled Mother Seed <clears throat> by Sandra Maria Estevez. Mother Seed. I approach the canvas like a birth, an empty beginning on a blank page, a discovering of secrets revealed in me. Think of a color, any color, the color of the day, the moment, lay it down, brush it across the virgin space, as far as it will go, staring at it, sometimes hours at a time. It becomes a meditation. It draws me into its world, fantastic, violent, more than I can see. And there, in that little patch of life, in that amorphous initiation, a road of associations leads me into its labyrinth of imagery. The montage unfolds. Dream and metaphor surface into form. Gather momentum on a journey I cannot reverse. Lay the cadmium next to cerulean. Pull it until it jumps out at me. Soft fade magenta into violet. Accept it. Gently settling into me. Then the final labor. Feverish push of form and meaning. Turbulent sky and funnel wind. Breathing and communion. Open mind and free space. A focusing that calls itself forth unstable earth and solid fire that demands to be seen for itself by itself, boundaries in personal dimensions on their own terms. This poem reminded me of the process that I experience sometimes with writing. You know, when you go to that blank page and you want to write something and uh, sometimes I just end up sitting there staring at a blank page, knowing that there's something in me to be birthed, but sometimes I just don't know. I guess I get caught up with the labor pains, <laughs> you know, it's like, it's like a whole process, you know? Um, and yeah, so this reminded me of that, you know, just sitting there and and sometimes we have writer's block or sometimes there's fear or sometimes there's intimidation with the stories that, you know, exist in you. And there's something about putting it on black and white, putting it on paper, you know, um, and then letting it unfold and manifest into whatever it's, it's meant to be. You know, because sometimes we can have an idea that happens also with, you know, other forms of art, like drawings and paintings. You can start off with a seed, a seedling of a thought on what it is you want to write about or draw about. And then all of a sudden it just in the midst of it. Like she said, it's like a form of meditation. It's just it just kind of unfolds to its truth. Yeah, that's pretty much it. So thank you for listening.